Welcome to ATP Customs. Well, today you guys get a weekly report. I haven't done a video since the viewer's choice when you guys picked the dually for our next build. Just because I didn't have anything exciting and I didn't want to waste your time. We are at a standpoint on a few projects because uh, we are waiting for tons and tons of parts. Like the Ford, we are waiting for our energy suspension bushing kit. We cannot put all the front end together. And it turns out you can't get Warren hubs for these anymore. They're discontinued. Warren has, uh, actually has no listing for them anymore. So we are now getting creative to find parts. Lots and lots of parts are discontinued for a 93 F-150. Surprising and disappointing. But we've literally just been sanding, prepping parts, painting them so that they're ready to go in as soon as our parts arrive. Uh, we have a new console has arrived. Have not unboxed it yet. And let's go look in the paint room. Why not? The 49 Ford. Look at that. It's beautiful. Yeehaw. And the interior just showed up today. So Mr. White just uh, got to fire up the spray gun again and got that handled. So now in the next couple of days, we get to throw the cab on here. And amazingly enough, the guys at Old Car Center in Langley actually had in stock all of the body bushings for the cab in the box. So it'll be a few days before those are in our hands, but we can now put the cab on at least. We can put it on before the bushings are here, not a big deal. Put the fuel tank in it and actually start wiring this thing up to get it running. That's so exciting. Put the interior in it, you know, all the fun stuff. That's been a long time, this one. And tomorrow, tomorrow is a big day. Tomorrow is actually a very big day. While you guys are watching this video, I am headed to the scrapyard with the trailer to go get my 59 Belvedere. And I think that car has been sitting there for 40 years. So tomorrow is a very, very special day that I will film for you guys. And the one ton dually is at the frame shop. It is on the frame rack and I imagine it should be done tomorrow too. So we're going to be swamped with vehicles. We're always swamped with vehicles. And look at that. The burnout machine. My big block Ford. is alive and well. I mean really well. My friend Doug went to town on this thing and we haven't even done the timing. I'm not even touching the gas. Let's see what happens. Ooh, maybe one pump. Ho <laughs> ho It's alive and it's got some stank to it and I did not realize that it potentially has posi because I have two black marks in my shop now and it was completely loaded with parts in the back so uh, there's a pretty good chance this thing has posi but it runs spectacular so we have a broken brake line have to build a whole new brake line and I actually think I found the fuel tank since the uh, the side tank is discontinued you can't get that so I did find a set of tanks laying around that I think will work for this to make us roadworthy and that is where we're at we are at fix a brake line put the tanks in and it's burnout time for this thing but listen to that it runs so good and uh, yeah it's got it's got a lot of torque. It'll tear the tires right off this thing. So, we're making progress here, there, and everywhere. Just wanted to give you guys a little update on why we haven't been filming in the last week. We're just waiting around for stuff, so we're puttering. Puttering on these little details. Oh, I can't wait to burn the tires off this thing. <laughs> so that's it for today. Next video's 
have to do with the one-ton dually and the Belvedere. So thank you for watching, and I hope you subscribe.